guys, welcome back to another Cars review. Today we're doing a review on Miss Fritter, which is a new Cars 3 diecast from the Cars 3 movie. So this is this diecast is a school bus. It's got a metal base. I mean, it does it's got a metal top and a plastic base. It is a very heavy vehicle. Miss Fritter, I like it a lot. It's got ch chains holding on the headlight and stuff and the hood it says school bus I like her expression she looks pretty intimidating quite the exhaust pipes on it it's got a stop sign that's shaped like a like a chainsaw blade or like a circular saw blade it does not come out it only opens that far it's got a Park Avenue sign and a lot of license plate it says Miss Fritter 58. Don't know what that's supposed to stand for. It's Fritter Time, it says. The license plate is Fritter Time, as you can kind of see. More license plates hanging on the side in 58. This car, I don't think that it, it needs to like have some mud on it like the new Dr. Damage does. Be it, because for like a, like a demolition derby race and like a dirt track, it's not dirty enough for my taste and also what most of other people say. So let's compare this school bus to some other like vehicles like it. So next to it we have, I forget what this guy's name is. He's from a Plains movie, I'll try to remember. Now I remember his name is Old Jammer. I gotta look these things up when I or remember these things. I've got too many cars to remember. So, old Jeremy, he's also a bus, but it's an old style bus, and Miss Fritter is a little bit bigger. They're about the same size, though. Next, we have Trudy Trailway, which is a trailway style bus. It is not a school bus, and it's a lot shorter, but it's longer. And last we have Larry Camper, which is not a bus, it's a camper, and it's bigger, but it's mostly made of plastic, except for the front. I like Miss Fritter, it's a really cool die cast, and since there haven't been any school bus models in the first Cars movies, it's kind of nice to have that. I also like the wheels, how they have wrenches painted on them. And a couple more things I missed. The back bumper it looks like it's been rear-ended a few times. It also it says school bus and stuff. And yeah, I would say that that does it for a review on Miss Fritter. Thanks for watching.